Yes, I'm good. Alright, one, two, three, one, two, three. Testing, testing. Alright, everything seems to be good so far. It seems to be good right now. Uh, sorry about my voice. I'm still a, uh, a bit sick. But anyway, uh, if you know audio is garbage, let's go. All right. Alright. Alright, so <laughs> uh keep my eye on chat. But yeah, it's assuming everything keeps going right. Knocking on wood. Uh let's go to Rusty Bucket Bay, because I think that was the last thing uh we unlocked. I just need to remember how to actually get there. Let's see here. Um, wait, did we get the thing up there? No, we didn't. Oh, do we have to go do the whole work and roll? No, I think I know how to do it now. So let's just get this out of the way. Uh, er, I won't spend too much time on it. But, if I can get this done right now, that'd be handy. Hug this wall. What? I was jumping on it. Get out of here. Okay, I'll do that one, one, one more time. That was, uh... That was rude. I just want to be... Funny little... Thing. Also, I should have killed those enemies, but whatever. Nice. So, seven out of the ten, uh, hub world, or, you know, the Gratilda's Lair jiggies. So that's good. Um, wait, how do we get to Rusty Bucket Bay? If that's what I'm trying to get to, I just kind of forgot how. Here? No, okay, no, that's the normal way into here, I think. Yeah, okay. Wait. Um, is Rusty Bucket Bait from down here? But, oh yeah, to answer, uh, chat, Pitmon. So I think that means three levels ago? I... Actually, I think it's... Two. It's Rusty Bucket Bay, and then Clockwork 
This cuckoo, whatever. You know, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. I think. Uh, I forgot the, the exact name of it, but yeah, we're really close to the end. <laughs> Oh, running too fast. Oh uh, yeah, I don't we're very close to finishing this. Thank you. I'll take that. Um, do I have to wait for that to open? Oh! Oh, can I... Uh... Oh, yeah, I'll take, I'll take a gold feather. Oh, click Clockwoods. I think that's it. And then it's like the... Uh... You know, the quote, final confrontation. And then, like, the actual final confrontation. Matilda, what does that mean? <laughs> if you think I'm rather soft, I'll be loft. Like, is that supposed to be intimidating? Or... What? It's a pokey! Oh my god! That dancing whisper. Whisper jam. Love it. <laughs> I'm guessing that you either completed. Uh, what should we call it? Oh, yes, either completed the, the sewer level or just put it off till next Vampire the Masquerade stream. Yeah. Oh, nice. Like that. All the witch switches. Um. Have I hit all the witch switches? Um, uh, uh, oh, I guess there are a on. Did you hit all the witch switches? I don't think so. Or I might have. I'm not sure. I didn't check here too thoroughly, just because, you know, I just got here. Well, I mean, I've been poking the other things around here. Mm. Uh, actually, let me view totals real quick. Um... It'd be right. Okay, I can't go to the main hub. Or er, look at the main hub. What? Here. I think I'm getting close to hitting all the Gratunda layer, um, you know, the witch switches or whatever. Oh, yeah, okay, Spiral Mound. But yeah, we're now in Rusty Bucket Bay, the second water level in this game. Game, let me...
Ah, oh, you think I missed two of them? Oh yeah, I guess, uh, Pokey script. I think you missed two of them, huh? Huh, no, I... Maybe? It's hard to tell, also. Okay, I thought I put more in there. What? Uh, Pidmon, now nah, it's level 8 of 9. Oh, okay. Okay, I can't ground pound. Okay, that worked. Uh, those switches and level that you hit. I think I've hit all of them. It's... Um... Hard to remember which ones I... Like, I'm pretty sure I've hit all that I've come across. Well, yeah. No, no, it's obvious. Come on, let me get up. No, give me a second to actually get on land and not drown. Not for Kate. From this fucked up sludge. Although there's something crying. I forgot what it was. Um. You know what? I still feel like being stubborn checking this out, but. Um. Oh, oh actually, let me uh, catch up with the chat. Come on, those are the switches and levels that you hit. Uh, any of those unfamiliar to you? I think if you miss any, it might be one in the pyramid ceiling crushing maze. Dolphin. It, uh, Pokey script. Dolphin. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I vaguely remember there being a dolphin in, somewhere in this game. Yeah, that tracks. Uh, and yeah, I think if the maze... I remember searching all throughout the maze. I don't know if the maze actually... Has a switch in it. Because I remember going all through, like running up about it again and again. To try to find, uh, some goodies. Ah! Also, um, I forgot how much, yeah, uh, Grintilda polluted, to be honest. Like, for some reason, I wasn't expecting it. And a part of me... God. Terrifying. But, uh... Um, great. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, like... Um, I guess... A part of me wondering earlier, it was like, oh, would it make, you know, before I started this, like, would it make sense <laughs> to joke about any characters in here being in NFTs or whatever? But, I mean, like, I honestly feel like Matilda would very much be into NFTs or just anything that destroys the environment, I guess. Well, then again, I say that, but would she? Because obviously, she loves polluting. She's a very high polluting lady, but like, I'm guessing 
the Rocky Bucket Bay and other places, you know, the Lakers have, like, those have a benefit for her in some way. But, like, I don't know if she'd be into NFTs for, like, a quick buck, or it's like, well, I can't really do anything with them. Because I actually have, like, factories or whatever that, like, produce things for me. Oh. Yep, oh. No, you're right. <laughs> she would. She'd scan them. Hammered. Yeah. That's one thing about this game. It's just being bodied by the camera. If, you know, cameras were are, were hard. I mean, cameras still are hard. It's just that we've gotten better at them. Wait. Show me the world beyond. Yeah, I wonder if I can... Okay, that's not high enough jump. Or far enough jump, got it. Just thought I'd give that a shot. But yeah, no, it... <laughs> you can tell that would absolutely scam people. God, that is great. Without playing, you know, Banjo-Tooie yet, I'm, like, wondering... <laughs> like... Which one of these characters, like, which Banjo character could get, like, mo most easily suckered into NFTs? And now, I'm thinking, like, you know that, that one get, or get the one, like, meme, or whatever, or it's like, doesn't know what an NFT is, doesn't invest in them, does know what they are, doesn't invest in them, doesn't know, <laughs> you know, like, that kind of, you know, You know, that whole deal. And... Oh no! Banjo! Watch out! Thanks, <laughs> good Tilda, for not trapping me down there. That's, that's surprisingly kind of you. Um... Huh. Hi. Hi. But yeah, um I feel like Kazooie at first okay, I think Kazooie wouldn't know what an NFT is. But would probably get into it. What? Uh, thank you, Gratilda, for the, uh, safety PSA about don't touch hot stoves. I appreciate that. Oh, okay. Just make sure that didn't, like, open or whatever. <laughs> don't <laughs> Pinmon, don't poop where you eat Kazooie. God. God. That, okay, no, I, I think... Like, a, a funny redeeming way... What? Never mind. I was about to say, if uh, Kazooie getting into NFTs is just... She just has, like, fake ones or whatever. It's like, ah, yes, buy my NFT for this funny, I don't know, funny ape or whatever, I don't know, but it's like, the you know, she just sends them a bit dot L-E or L-Y to just a text file, it's like, 
thanks for the money, nerd. And then she realizes, like... <laughs> yeah, I love that. Sludge the monster. Um, wait. I feel like this is a game that would, like, ah, you, you add eggs to the soup. And that does something, but I guess not. Is there anything to do here? Other than get hurt trying to... <laughs> Huh. Really nothing to do here. Uh, we can't go through there. Nothing there. Okay, sure. This is a this has been a weird side path, but sure. Bah! <laughs> Ah! What? It eats me. <laughs> what do I do about it? Okay, I can't avoid it if I get close. Oh! There you are. Um, sure, let's hit you up. I need a transformation or something? Or, no, it's probably just on the boat. I do something. Oh, wait. Hmm. I should go get some air. Let me... Whoops. I was trying to jump to get something, but oh well. Not jiggies. Tired. <laughs> That's my excuse. Okay, well, that's just an extra life, which isn't the most important thing in the world. Oh, hey, there's a door. There. No, it's not a door. Looked like a door from that angle. Whatever. Uh. Anything for me to do here? No. Oh. Okay, anything for killing this fish? Look at that. Well, never mind. Is there something invisible chasing after me? It's just the splash of the water. Okay, it's just a splash of the water. I don't know. Maybe I'm getting a bit paranoid. Or vaguely remembering some video game having something like that, where it's just if you get in the water. Tiny sludge mo Jim Joe's. Wait, is there a Jim Joe down there? I'm not hearing one. Oh, the video is stuttering on here. Okay, apologies. Oh, 
Oh. Pitmon, uh, oh no, I, uh, I still thought you were talking about Jim Joe earlier when I forgot the name of something. Ah, uh, okay. That's more than fair. Also, that's so dark on my screen, I can barely see anything. <laughs> Lovely. You know what? That's not how Okay, no, I just turned off a light in my room. Didn't really Oh, come on. I know the timing for this. Ahoy! Alright. We... I think we got all the collectibles down here. And now, Dolphin is gonna give us a Jiggy. Hey! <laughs> yeah. Ahoy. Yeah. Ahoy! Love these goofy little goblins. Just saying ahoy. And, yeah. <laughs> Finman, not, uh, Finman. Also love every time the anchor just clips right through our dolphin buddy, and yeah, it really does. It's great. Where's... Where's their present from dolphin buddy? Oh wow, it's underwater. Thanks. I mean... Dolphin Buddy is a dolphin. Like, there's not there's not many places it, it could have been. over here, is there? Nope. Alright. I mean, I would swim in the water, but <laughs> to, to see more, because I can barely see any uh, anything over here, but um, the, the floor, oh, I would say the floor is lava, but just the water is uh, Adios, lifesaver. Yeah, it's just, uh... Can't breathe. Under the earth, not breathe. The water just makes us choke. Which is terrifying to think about. Yeah, 
I hate to see it, folks. He can bulk him. Come on, let me jump. Let's see here, anything else? Woo! Potentially hiding Whee! behind ca a weird camera position. Woo! No. Alright, sure. <laughs> no! Wait. I don't need that. Okay, so the lighter one is actually a monster. Good enough. That's beak proof, at least. But we can mess with whatever the hell this is. Ah, nice. Oh, okay, so it makes it slow down for a little bit. Or it makes those fans slow down for a little bit. Alright. Better than nothing. No, oh, hey, Jim, 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 Joe. Yeah, <laughs> I just thought uh, was you know busy uh, exploring, but uh, yeah, totally, it's now playable to get past those big fans. Also, just getting the angle right, yeah. And also, oh, what? Ah, I was hoping that big run could work. Oh, let's get back up there. Uh, may want to hit up one of those uh, beehives. Hmm. 
Oh no, I was trying to run across there like a fool. Which, you know what? Still may work. Wait, uh, trial run. Okay, never mind. Probably won't. So let's mess around down here. After getting some goodies. What? Go uh huh? Um. Oh, I guess I have to go all the way over here. Oh, you pay multiple times on the cheaper ones. I didn't know that. Need to go back to the first one then. Well, well don't really need to per se, but just have some goodies. Oh, hello. Here. I think so. I mean, other than breaking the beehive now, which, you know, wouldn't do anything for me. Oh, yeah, that's how you get the Jumbo Mumbo token. Gold feathers, yeah. I kind of want to do that now, just to get that out of the way. Gosh, this level has a lot of back and forth <laughs> if you're not doing uh, an optimal route. Oh, and I still have to save that little buddy. I have no idea how I would do that. Oh. Um, I bet there's a way to... What? Nope, oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, they're back. Up a uh, great white tail. Yeah, I could have sworn I tried paying this toll before. Was I just not close enough? Weird. I th Anyway, I'm get I'm guessing I need a power up or something not power up, uh transformation something. Anyway. Let's get back over there. That Jimbo, Jim Joe, Jimmy Boy, the Django, what have you. James Joseph. Also, let's get this out of the way. Kim J. 
Banjo acquired. Uh, else over here. Oh, I just don't notice the stuff up there as well. Oh! oh. Cameron. Love it. Thanks, game. Love when the camera just turns on me. Alright, that worked. Um, well, I guess I'll find wherever that is. <laughs> Whoops. Uh. Oh, didn't know it was this tiny door before. that all that's down here bees wait nice 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 you, you love to see it yeah we're now inside and I can't okay now I can move the camera Got a platform. Ooh. All right, there's safer ways to do that, but I didn't know about that. What? Well, time to die. Or not? Time to not die. What? <laughs> okay. Sure. Also, thank goodness this is the Xbox 360 version. Well, I mean, oh yeah, Xbox 360 version playing on the uh, Xbox One. Either else, I would have needed to. Uh, Redo. What all would I need? I know I would have to redo all the music notes. Which sounds like a nightmare. Thank goodness that's not the case anymore. Oh, wait. Um. Three. One. Yay, number <laughs> pattern recognition. But yeah, where? I don't know, this level's kind of weird. It really. It's pretty widely spaced out, I guess. 
so it's just like, it feels like I'm not making too much progress, but I, I do have like 70 out of, uh, you know, 73 out of 100 medical notes, one of the honeycombs. Uh, you know, I've, I've definitely made pro- oh, cam camera. But yeah, no, it's just, it can be hard to tell at times. It still feels like there's a lot to do here. Also, huh. I had honestly thought there'd be a transformation, so, uh... Map. Oh, I had to blow that up again as well. Huh. Like, it feels like a transformation would make sense of how do you deal with the, uh, shark. Oh. Oh, hey, Sai. Science. Uh, science mix. Um, science mix. If I recall, this level is one of the ones that they had the most of stuff removed from it. While it being made due to limitations, like they had plans to have the ship, the ship leave the harbor. Oh, it's really cool. And yeah, I can absolutely see that being the case. It's just like, yeah. There's a lot going on here already, and like the idea of there, like it feels like there should be more. <laughs> but, like yeah, I believe that. Or I guess not. Should should is a strong word. More of there could be more, like with what, you know, all the different components interacting together already. Um... Okay, let's... Faceplant. Oh! Oh, boss... Whoop! We'll never get that hit jigsaw, I guess. <laughs> what? Oh, I can just attack him. Okay, this definitely makes it just easier <laughs> to deal with all of them. Also, I totally remembered this boss fight, and that's why uh, <laughs> the stream, you know, slash episode subtitles, uh, Blue Eggs, obviously. I'm, I'm smart. I'm, I'm, so, I'm so smart. Y'all gotta believe. Also, thank you, Psyhead. <laughs> um, now um, to catch up with chat science, there's a painting of a captain in Mad Mo uh, Monster Mansion. And he would have been related to this level. Yeah, the, the sea captain. Yeah, the pirate captain or whatever. Uh, you see him, Banjo-Tooie, uh, Banjo lamenting the loss of his boat. He apparently owns this boat, huh? And, yeah, um, science <laughs> science makes... I think the gold feathers make short work of this boss. Yeah, they do. I, I kind of... <laughs> I keep forgetting that I have gold feathers. Like... You know, like, invincibility is useful, but it's easy to forget to, like, use it, you know, for most enemies, because you only have, like, ten, uh, at max, ten gold feathers at a time. 
Wait, you don't need to be there. Uh, do I need a gate? Definitely back in here. Huh. Hidmon, wasn't he also from an earlier cancelled game as a big bad that eventually was reused to make Star Fox Adventures? No? That'd be the first time I would hear I I've heard of that, but that's interesting to think about. Cause I know like Star Fox Adventures was like Crystal and you know, she'd be the the hero of it. You know, her own adventure, but then it got you know, kinda gobbled up into becoming a Star Fox game. And, you know, to read from chat, science, science mix. It's kind of wild how many times Rare had their games cancelled and then everyone wondered why Nintendo would want to get rid of them. And, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I think, actually, the, the Dino of Better Game or whatever that, you know, eventually became, uh, you know, Star Fox Adventures did actually get released. Like, I, I think, you know, what they had left was eventually... Oh, come on! Rude. Rude. <sighs> okay, one life left to give. Um, wow, it resets that. Good no. Anyway! You know what? With that... Mm, whatever. Let's just try to get through that root room. Yeah, I, I remember hearing a bit ago that, like, that game got released as a Nintendo 64 game. And, like, you can just... There was, like, a download for the ROM and everything or whatever online. Oof. Uh, science... Science mix. I played Star Fox Adventures and playing it felt like a chore. Then at one point, Fox fell through the world into a void and I lost several hour progress. Oof. That's wild. Uh, sorry for that prompt to song! Oh, it's just... Oh, there's one behind the ship. Well, I guess I had to not die and get that. And... Uh, now what? I'll ignore the eco bokums for now. The, the mumbo tokens. Come on, slow down. Come on. But, uh, <laughs> anyway, I'll ignore the Eagle Bokums for now, just because uh, I feel like I would have to do a high jump, or a backflip jump or whatever, to be able to get them. And I don't want to do that on <laughs> those uh, rotating plot, you know, those rotating uh, walkways or whatever. I mean, technically, they're more like, not pistons, axles? Yeah, they're all like axles, you know. Yeah. Oh, you know what? Let me go back the other way, I guess. And, um, 
also <laughs> to gamble with chat. Uh, yeah, no, that, uh, sorry to hear about, you know, Bidlin for, uh, gave up on, you know, Psychonauts could see the auto save and then power outage. And then just being like, I guess I'm done, yeah. That's, uh, that's never fun. But, huh? I got to answer Syhax what you meant for how much vaccine do you want. I, honestly, I did this game before. Do I have to go back? To activate, the, I have to go back. That makes sense. I was like, oh, how come this is being weird? Yeah, okay. I was gonna say, before <laughs> my uh, epiphany, that I've beaten this game before 100% without looking at guys or anything, so like, I don't really mind any, like, hits. But, yeah, I think what is happening here is that there's something I activated earlier that I thought would save over from my deaths, but didn't. Now, so I was like, um, this is being weird. I think it's over here? Ah, uh, here it is. Yeah. Here. You need to press that. Like, they'll speed up, but they'll occasionally slow down, and that's what's important. And I guess while that other thing is up, I'll, um, go get the... Uh, Jiggy at the back of the boat. Uh, to save that progress. Am I at the back of the boat? Am I at the front of the boat? <laughs> I know! <laughs> I know boats. Don't worry about it. But... <laughs> and don't worry, Zyax. Um, I guess to read. Uh, but yeah, no, like, I... Yeah, there's definitely the two switches. I think one resets on death and the other one may be permanent. But also, yeah, I... Maybe there was a timer? It's hard to remember precisely. Wait. Uh. Also, I just realized something. Also, I'm going to die. going to die. I'm going to suffocate <laughs> on land. I'm not going to suffocate on land. Alright. Here you go, little buddy. No, I just pressed that one a bit ago, then again, Steam Light, er, Stream. Like, ah. Uh... Okay, I think I know what I'm thinking about. But, <laughs> yeah, it's, yes, I think Oily Bear has uh, breath holding skills tested. This is immensely evolved this place. Um, so I activated that switch. I think 
The switch I'm thinking about is in here. Also, I pre I uh, simply adore that. Uh, that. <sighs> anyway, I simply adore. Uh, let that flip around. That's the switch I'm thinking about. I don't know if this one's permanent. Or was I just supposed to wait? I was supposed to just wait. Just jump through there. Oof. Rude, 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 rude. Uh, I don't know what all saves on the game over. I remember, f <laughs> to be honest, my first time going through this game was actually this version of the game. Like, oh, played it at a friend's house. Because, like, uh, when it came on N64, but, like, I never owned one. But I vaguely remember that if I game over, I have to re-input the cheats for the, uh, extra, uh, eggs and the, uh, extra feathers. Which isn't, like, the worst thing in the world, but still, like... Wait, I have to go back first. Uh, this one absolutely does not reset on death. Or it does reset on death. Alright, so, got that switch pressed, um, what else am I thinking about? Wait, how many Jimbo's? Okay, I'm missing two, I know where one is. Right over there, in that corner of the, uh, the map. I'll try going... Actually, wait. I'm kind of worried about game over -ing. Like, I forget how severe that actually is in this version of the game. So I'll try hitting that up. For a, uh... What? Uh, for a extra life that should be there. Or I think he should be there. I forget if the extra lives respawn. To be honest, but uh, okay, I saw it. Maybe just didn't pick it up. It sounds like something I would do. Die. All right, so. Alright, we have an extra life. <laughs> hey, ba oh, sub! Oh, I didn't know it was a squid raid. Sup, Hank?
Great. Ah, how are you doing? How's your stream? Um, flash, not flash. What's the name of that game? Uh, Phoenix Point. That's the one. I was about to say Crab Point, though fitting. Not that's not what it's called. Ah, you hit a super hard mission. Crab Point. I mean, it's a game about crabs. It's like, oh, what if? The cancer is, you know, the, um, I can never remember how to pronounce it, but you know, the, the crab evolution thing. What if that, but violent? Like, that's the whole, like, deal. Also, we're gonna rescue this, this friend. What? I didn't think? Oh, I thought I was... All right. Carcinization. Carcinization, yeah. It's like that, but like, what if crabs take over the world and Cthulhu, crab Cthulhu's? I forget if they're normal Cthulhu's or crab Cthulhu's. I mean, it, it could be either way. Ah, so it's both crab Cthulhu's and normal Cthulhu's. W wonderful. Space crab Cthulhu's. You know, wouldn't want it any other way, you know? Don't, you know, don't accept any substitutes when it comes to crab Cthulhu's. They aren't from space. I only have one of the honeycombs in this level. Okay, yeah, I do have to hit that again. Camera. Work with me. Oof. Okay, now what? Uh, have a good night, Pink. Have fun with Bear and Bird backpack game. Yep. Love it with the Bear and Bird. Uh, relax. for backpack time. Oh, that said, does Kazooie ever get out of the backpack? Like, I think even, like, she s sleeps inside the backpack. I had to hit both. God. Oh, it is time. No, oh, Sayang, so right. Uh. I, I, I just, I. Ah. Uh, I just want to get this jiggy. No, 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 no. Alright, I'll get... I'll get the thing. The back of the boat. The propellers. I'm getting this and wait for the timer to go down. Ah. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting I have gold feathers that make me invincible. Thank you, Sai! 
Thanks for the reminder, but oh, okay, that's good to know then. Banjo Tui, that was made cell point of it, of that she can get out of the backpack and divide puzzles and whatnot. Also, every time I do that, it makes the camera change. This game. <sighs> this is rude. Alright, so... Wait, I probably would have wanted to hit the other- Oh, I can jump through. Game, stop changing the camera, please. Thank you. <laughs> I'm a bit more stressed out about this than I thought I would be. Oof. Alright. We're getting through this. I'm not going to jinx myself. Let's do this. Do it. I'm going to wait for that to go. I'm going to try not to suffer as the, the camera tries to fight me the rudest way it knows how. Come on, Banjo! Come on. Right. And I failed. Because I didn't- I was trying to take a shortcut. And, yeah, no. Yeah, no. <laughs> Come on! Uh, Alright, CSIX, good luck with uh, caretaking. Hope everything goes well. Uh, is there another way out of here? Is the Ecom Bogums that I'm choosing to ignore. Is there a way out? Like... If it's up to me, I'd make it so that there's a way out of here, the place to get the jiggy, but that doesn't seem to be the case. Uh, no, I think maybe starting camera. Trying to leave on the other side, maybe a bit faster. Actually, uh, one entrance, one exit. All right, good to know. I mean, it'd be nice if that wasn't the case. All right. Also, I can't believe the gold feathers don't help with this. Actually. Yeah, no, they don't help with this, huh? You have to... Just jump across. Yeah, no. Because the... Yeah, it's not solid ground between the... colors. So you just have to... Ah. <laughs> wow. How many musical notes? I'm missing 15. Missing 15? 
I'm missing 15. How am I missing 15? No, I'll worry about that later. Let's try. Um. Part of me is wondering: Should I continue trying to get that that deal? But at the same time, I'd rather not have to come back and do it later. Yeah, no, this is starting to be <laughs> more of a hassle than anything. Like, okay, getting gold feather there, but yeah. I'm just... Uh, and, like, you know, yeah. Um, not, you know. Let me actually articulate my thoughts. My thoughts on the matter are, this kind of blows that your punishment mistake for platforming here is death. Like, there's there's just no other real consequence other than dying if you get knocked off the platform. And it's... <laughs> right? If it was just a platforming challenge and you get a jiggy for getting there, I'd be cool with that. But it's like, you had to get a... You had to activate two separate switches and then get out of here quick enough get all the way over here quick enough specifically and that's what's bugging me because it's like I can get because it's just yeah you know, the fact that again any mistake leads to just death over there It's just kind of a hassle of trying to figure it out. Especially since I must. Play this out. Alright. Also, screw fall damage. Uh. Well, I guess if just if I have to jump across things, just I right, got that taken care of. Which one's faster to, to the return trip? Maybe this one. Or maybe the other one. Oof. Sorry, just shuffling, <laughs> shuffling, uh, shuffling, shuffling about. Change of position. Snake eater in so long. I forgot how it goes. Hey. Come on. <sighs> All right. 
right. We did it. Rusty bucket. Quick. Twenty cross, England. Twenty cross. Twenty cross. Huh. Good thing that may be a real place <laughs> that you know people in rare know about. <laughs> ah, thank you, Pitmon. Mm, quoting Pitmon with darkness and silence in the night. Okay, um, while I try to look for the last remaining collectibles, how about I try to remember how uh, Stay Here goes? What a thrill! A silence! The darkness and silence in the night. No. Damn. Okay, now a boarding mission. I'm struggling with you. <laughs> Too scared, brain. Oh, hello. Oh, cool, so this is where. The, at least some of the hidden meter notes are. Ah! Oh, we got a, a bear trophy. Darkness, silence. Uh. So great now. I, I pardon me, still <laughs> trying to remember Snake Eater, but I am just brains refusing to cooperate. Uh, did I get everything in here? Yeah. Yeah. That said, I still don't have the second honeycomb either. Actually, um, let me check the totals. I need 11. Yeah, I need 11 more musical notes, two more jiggies. One more honeycomb. Oh yeah. Can I hit that? From no, I, I absolutely cannot hit that from over here. Uh. Wait, could I? F Let me try to see if I can bunt mash my way up there. I absolutely cannot bunt mash my way up there. Not surprising. The middle of the blue container is hit. Um. I'll try that in second month. Uh, dear. Wait. Oh, throw just so you can get out. Let's go over here. Oh, I almost had. Oh, for a second there, I had 69 eggs. Damn. Oh wait, I think I know how you... Okay. 
I saw this from above earlier. But, like, I didn't do anything with it because I was preoccupied. Yeah. Alright, I hear Jim Joe, Jimmy John, Jim, Jim, Jim Jams. I'm hearing one of them around here. I'll, I'll find you yet, little buddy. Oh! Nice! Still missing some. I'm gonna call it money. But there's no. You don't purchase anything in this game. Get out. Um. Wait. Okay, I still need 11. Which is an odd number, which worries me. I hope I didn't miss, like, one again. And it, I'm not. <laughs> oh no. Ah, there, you can bulk them up there. Now this one I can get. Wait, whoop, the ball is. Got camered again. Where I was like, oh yeah, from first person camera. I just move here, go over here, it's all good. Oh, and excuse me for a bit. I need to plug in my laptop so that it doesn't die on me while streaming. Uh, that would be bad. Alright, but... You know what? I'm glad that at least today, com you know, compare especially compared to last uh, week's stream, I am in a much better mood than I was around the same time. But I know, like, then I was just... Kind of having secrets are there in the, the yellow end. Um, anyway, I was having a much rougher time there. Just because I felt like, oh, I should have been through here already. Hmm. Um. <laughs> Right. Um, okay, I have to get up there from the boat way. Oh. I'm missing. I guess I have to try the other... Uh, some other path. No, I don't think I've ever been in this area. Looks like the doors to the front are locked. But surely... It's the door. All the doors are sh shut. Trying to see if I can ground pound. Okay, I don't think I'm supposed to ground pound up there, or down into here, if it's that much of a hassle. Well, that was worth a shot, at least. Alright. There's some area up here I neglected going to. 
even though I'm missing 11 music notes. And I've been up there. The yellow Jim Joe? Um. Oh, give me a sec to get over. Yeah, I remember the area of the yellow Jim Joe. It's right there. It's a danger. I'm guessing you're about to tell me that uh, there's a whole bunch of stuff over there I never got. Oh wait, no, it's not over there. It was that was Yellow Jimbo. Hey, Jimbo. Let me see if this has anything. Oh, there's an entrance into a warehouse there from within the chomper water. Okay, that means it's not gonna crack. Is there any hint of that? Okay, I think I may see it. Well. Oh, yep, yeah, I see it. Uh, where am I? Chomper just bit me the next week. Come on. What? Why are you trying it? Get out of here. Huh. Oh, I'm so okay. Am I supposed to fly out of here? Burst through the window? All that? Oh! Nice. Wait. There's no musical notes in here. Where? Where, where are the musical notes? Well, no, hopefully flying around will get me that. I forgot that it aims where you're pointing. It can aim where you're pointing uh, the bear. The, like, or, or I guess where you're trying, where you're actually flying towards. Uh, did you break the windows on the ship? What are you talking about? Um. Oh, okay, sorry. Uh, jump water. Okay, uh, let me catch- <laughs> quote what you're saying and read all of it. Uh, there's an entrance to the warehouse, uh, or Pinman. There's an entrance from the warehouse from the chomper water, if I recall correctly. I'll remember this part, sorry. <laughs> uh, did you break- 
Windows on the ship? Not, not sure about that. Also, yeah, I don't think I can break out of here, because let me try something again. Because I was partially hoping... Well... Yeah, no. There's no way to get out. From there, or from flying at least, which is a shame, because I was hoping flying was the key to getting out of here. Okay, also was hoping that might do something. But, yeah. I was hoping, you know, flying around could get you access to something. Shut up, Chopper. I am busy. Anything down here that I can tell? For easier tra uh, traversal, let me. Get this going. Yeah, no, I. What? I guess what am I missing? I guess, um. I don't know if I need to go back down there. I got the Jim Jinmo that. I've been down there like so many times. Let me try another. Um What are these? Oh. I know I can't. That. What? Oh, rude. Alright, thank you for the hint, dear, about breaking the windows. Oh, hey! Hey, this little fun guy. I bet you know he's really great. And you now a really popular character even. God. It's so weird to think about Conquer. Like especially <laughs> you know, it's just originally gonna be like, oh and, and, uh, you know, yeah, another happy go lucky rare mascot platformer. And until they're like, no what, we're kinda bored. And they made the funny little alcoholic man <laughs> the by Pokey Script, yeah. <laughs> feather pillows. <laughs> oh yeah, that's a funny gag, the feather pillows. But yeah, god, like I've never played Conquerors Bad for a day. I don't know if it's actually like fun <laughs> is the thing. <laughs> But yeah, I mean, I like I can kind of understand like the reasoning of just like we keep making cute, you know, cute characters. What if we made just made? What if we just made a bastard? And you know what? I guess I'm glad they were able to have fun with that. Oh, according to... Oh, it's okay most of the time. Ah. I guess I can see that. I know... God, I know there's a lot going on in that game. I know there's a broom that's gay, I think. I 
think I know there's a, an alien reference. And he's a less jiggy. Ah, okay, from what you remember most. <laughs> uh, ages ago, yeah, that's fair. I know there's that silly... Poop monster. I'm missing four. Oh no, I'm missing four in music notes. Oh no. Oh no. Missing four. Are you evil? Okay, you're not evil. Okay, you don't cook an egg. In, well, you wouldn't cook an egg in an oven most of the time. So, like, that tracks. If it's gonna be another ship window, it's fine. Okay. That's good. Banjo, pick up the knife. Okay, Banjo, don't pick up the knife. God. Now my brain went to several different places, but I just imagined, like, what if Banjo... Like, what if there's a creepypasta about, like, Banjo, but, like, Banjo just absolutely refuses to do anything, like, dark or fucked up or, like, or edgy. It's like, like, there's blood splashes everywhere, there's a knife, but, like, like, oh, I tried getting Banjo to pick up the knife, but Banjo refuses to do anything. It's just like, yo, this is messed up. <laughs> I can't, I think, you, I think you need to return the game. Like, this is <laughs> Like, this shouldn't be allowed. This is rated G. Like, get out of here. Dad, oh, <laughs> I've in chat. Dad joke, dad joke, Kazaki. Yeah. Huh. I'm guessing this is probably from their... An idea, well, some of their expanded ideas that probably are different islands, or whatever. Alright, so. Okay, no, I got everything. Yeah. Yeah! Rusty Bucket Bay completed. Well, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Weird, I thought this place would have a transformation. I think I'm getting confused. Okay, I know click clock, uh, click talk, or but. <laughs> I know there's one that does have a, uh. a transformation. I think. Or, or, uh, the next one does. At the very least. I think it's a B? Which is cute. But... Um... Mm. Oh, wait. What does this raise up? Wait, I think I know where that is. I just need to get back over there. But yeah, I don't think I'll hit up another level this stream. 
Even like this took almost two hours. I think I'll, you know, use the uh, remainder to or set things up at least for the next level. Oh yeah, no, that was what we needed to get over into Rusty Bucket Bay. But, um, that, where's that waterlogged place? I mean, it's probably connected over here. So it should be easy enough to get to. Okay, that's, that's cool. Is that it? <laughs> oh yeah! I think I knew of one person, uh, <laughs> to quote Poke, <laughs> Poke's script, uh, Conquer had weirdly shooter-based multiplayer. If you go for rare uh, replay achievements, you'll be spamming the multiplayer modes in single player. Oh boy. Delightful. Thankfully, I don't really go for achievements unless it's something really fun. Or, no, sometimes I'll go for them. It, I guess it just kind of depends, but yeah. Oof. Also, yeah. I <laughs> love getting burnt underwater. I mean, these are weird magic torches. So, like, yeah, that's fair, I guess. Oh, yeah. Wait. Two... To Banjo Dewey and oh, I know uh, Donkey Kong 64 had uh, shooter modes for multiplayer. I did know two. Wait, wait. Banjo script. Uh, yeah, but two D was full Golden Eye. Conquer's weirdly not that, huh? It was full Golden Eye. Wild. Oh, uh, I should surface for air before I get the Baron, b Baron Bird. Uh, dead. Oh, wow, there's multiple levels in Section 2 in there, Goldeneye? Oh, wow, that's great. Wait, yeah, did Rare make Goldeneye? I don't know if they... I forget who did. You know what? Using the power of having a laptop. Uh... Oh my. Uh... 64. Um... Yeah! Wow! I forgot... Yeah! I was like... I forgot, I keep forgetting that that was a rare game. Yeah, Perfect Dark. <laughs> Which I have on... Wait. Um, yeah, I have on Rare Replay, but I haven't picked up yet. Or I haven't touched yet. I should say. Which, I, no, I, I love learning at some point, you know, um, oh, hello. <laughs> but, um, oh yes, that's, you know, someone eventually found a way to mod Perfect Darker. Or some, you know, some way, or port to PC, or something. One of those two, and discover that basically, yeah, if you play the game with keyboard and mouse, 
uh, you just <laughs> you can just obliterate everything, like like comically so, where you're just uh. I don't know the best way to get through that, but whatever. Hey, boy. Oh yeah, but, uh, you know, just nothing in the game was meant for, you know, that level of precision, so... Basically, with keyboard and mouse, you're just able to... Oh yeah, I can get through there if I want. Well, which I guess wouldn't be a bad idea. Just let me just see what this is about. Oh! Hello, Bertelda. <laughs> yeah, let me get my notes ready for that. But yeah, just... You're able to just run around behind things and shoot them in the back of the head. Which is funny to think about. Alright, just checking that disco real quick. But anyway. Oh, yeah, I need that. No pad plus plus open. For some more. Gratilda uh, trivia. Hmm. We've past time is bursting boils. Yep. Delightful. Uh, next one. Gracie Nat Grant. Okay, yeah, it's just Greasy Grant. For some reason, I thought I spelled it. Like, I, you know, misheard it. Or misread it. Okay. Sure. Thanks for being a hater on your sister, Bertilda. <laughs> I'm sure somehow this will be useful to everyone. Oh. Oh, that's wrong. Ah, oh, there it is. Yep, tick the TikTok clock entrance. I oh, had nice one, though. Oh, wait! Yeah, that drops that all the way back towards the uh, beginning. I think. Well, we backtracked to that. Hey, 
Oh wait, the this Okay, no, it just seems back here. Oh, Gobi Gobi's Valley? Um Now what that does sound like a plan. There's something Oh yes, I I have enough for this. Um, do I want to open that now? Do I lose anything? I don't think I would lose anything for opening that now. But... Oh, let's open that now, I think. Just so that... have this open for... oh wait is this what I think it is <laughs> okay 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 we're not doing that yet unfortunately um, wait I'm at the entrance to, to the Clockwoods, or whatever its actual name is, but let's... What? Come on, let me get out of there. But yeah, let, let's get out of here, check out Gobi's Valley, in case I did miss something there. Since there's only, like, one place, if I did miss something, where, like, it would have been. <laughs> See, where's Gobi's Valley? Forget. Going the wrong way. You no, know what? It. I can just go up to the cauldron and go back. You hit the switch by the force to turn on the podium, right? Yeah. Yeah. I made sure to do that before leaving that force area. Oh, wait, no, yeah, Gobi's Valley is down there. Er, more specifically over here? No. Wrong one. Uh, over there. I could just face tank it, but if I can just get the boots, I should just get those. Anyway, <laughs> despite that rudeness, let's get back here. If I miss any of these switches, it probably would be this one out of all of them. Uh, the pyramid maze, right? Which I think is over here? Wait, is it this one? No, I can keep checking them. Keep checking them, it's fine. Yep. King Sandy wants to turn back or face r his wrath. Alright. Not uh, to heed our warning. Prepare to run. I don't think 
it's in here. Er, son of a gun. Ah! <laughs> oh, hey! Hey, Del What's up? And we made it out with our hides. <laughs> hey, Shemmy. I don't know how to pronounce that. I was gonna read, but Twitch did tell me you were like, oh, dang. Yeah. Kazooie really does all the work. Uh, it's it's wild. And, yeah, thank you so much, uh, dear, for reminding me to go back here, because, like, yeah. This one really is... <laughs> uh, annoying to get. Bam Joe. Bam Joe. God. Sorry, it's just... <laughs> I'm thinking back to like, um, uh, uh, Metal Gear 5 and like Punish Snake, which is a shame that like a whole bunch of like fascists decided to run with that. And like, you know, that's just often used as their own dog whistle or whatever. Because the idea of just saying, <laughs> Punished banjos is really funny to me, but it's like, oh no, that's that's like a fascist thing. Oh no. <laughs> or like if I said that anywhere, like most people are like, oh damn, I can't believe he got yeah, hurt or sucks. And it's whack. But just banjo with eye patch trying to be all hardcore. It's, it's <laughs> something that makes me laugh. Nice! Grab it. Uh, did you find Kid Bay Overworld Jiggy earlier? Yeah. I believe so. Yeah, I did. There was one that, you know, I, uh, made up here from Rusty Bucket Bay that I was able to get later. And I have 9 out of Gratilda's lair. So yeah, Tick, uh, Tiki Talk Clock is the very last one. Um, no, I guess let's you know activate it or whatever. Whatever the thing is, um, insert the uh, the jiggies into the uh, the puzzle, so that it'll actually open up next time. Cause yeah. Ah, uh, Rune Phony. Is this- er, don't worry. I... I'm close to wrapping up. Where- Wait, where's the thing I'm looking for? Here... No... It's close to the beginning. But you know, before... I... Uh, this, you know, as the stream's right around, does anyone have any goofy, goofy rhymes that I could potentially try to say in which voice? Because unfortunately, the only, the one time I, I did that, I mean, I, I guess depending on who you ask, fortunately, unfortunately, it was like, good deal, not making it. Uh, a fucking, uh, uh, HP Lovecraft joke of all things. Like something like name my cat the same as HP Lovecraft or something. Something like that. Which, it was funny to read, but oh boy. <laughs> that, that sure was that sure threw me for, for a loop while, while I was reading it. On Earth is 
Carmen San Diego. Where on earth is the thing? I know you find it real early. Like. Um. Oh, hi, Sight. We went to, uh, what should I call it? We 100% Rusty Bucket Bay. There was... Get it up here. Down it. Uh, we 100% uh, Rusty Bucket Bay. We got some extra jiggies and stuff that were hiding out, uh, like, outside of the level. Uh, what else did we do? Oh yeah, we got to the tick, you know, tick, tick tock clock, uh, level entrance, and we made the puzzle piece thing dealy appear for. But I just need to find where it was because I know it's like fairly early in the game. But it's like you go to that room, but there's like nothing you can do there. Ah yeah, here it is. Play Clockwood. Okay. <sighs> yeah, and Pin, uh, Pin was right about Gobi Valley Maze with the, uh, the Miss Switch. So now we have nine out of the ten Fertilda layer uh, jiggies. That's fun. And yeah, for. But yeah, um, if I try to navigate underwater, yeah, I think that will be it. Cause I try to keep these streams, you know, about two hours. You know, except I have to go over time. I mean, for the witness, I would often go over time. But like, let, let's not talk about that. <laughs> let's, let's not talk about that. Um, but. Yeah, I think, like, I, like, I'm having fun, but, and I kind of want to continue, but I'm a bit tired, so I think it's probably wouldn't hurt to just, uh, you know, call it quits now. We have everything set up for, you know, Click Clockwood, and I think after that... It, is that the final level? I think that may be the final level. And then, you know, we obviously do... <laughs> the fi the uh, final confrontation with uh, Grunty herself, Gatilda. And then after we do that, we do the actual, actual final confrontation with Gatilda. So, like, that'll be fun. So, yeah, probably two more streams, because, like, I'm guessing, you know, these last, you know, these last two levels have been, like, you know, I've been freezing through the game at, like, two levels a stream for about two hours, and then, like, now each one is taking its own stream to do, uh, to just 100% everything. I, yeah, there's probably two more streams left until we beat this game, which... Gosh, this has been a really f this has been really fun to go back to, especially after you know for decompression after uh, the witness and like gosh those puzzles. Which speaking of which, at some point I do need to actually do bonus streams. I just need to make the time for them so that I can try to finish off some of the things in that game, like the challenge of just a timed puzzle gauntlet, but. Uh, we'll get to that later, but anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you had, yeah, a lot of fun, and that I can see y'all next week. And I guess, you know, just watch this out before we actually end the stream. Because it just, it just, you know... Catch me that this plays every time you quit the game. 
the game over screen. Oh! <laughs> Good night, and now, again, thank you all for uh, coming to watch. It really means a lot to me. And also have a uh, scary spice, Gruntilda. <laughs> but <laughs> hey, right, time to actually end this stream. So yeah, thank you, thank y'all. Have a good night. Uh, see you next week, and hopefully earlier for that, you know, before that for bonus stream stuff. But 